Hello, today I'm going to show you how to create this pattern. First open a new document. Now click on the Line Segment tool, hold and select the Rectangular Grid tool. Double click on it again to open the dialog box. Set the Horizontal and Vertical Dividers to 7 and click OK. Now click on the artboard, hold and drag. While you are dragging your mouse, press the Shift key as well to keep it proportional. Let's swap the fill and the stroke and change the fill to a bright color. Next, we'll paint some of the squares black to get our desired pattern. It is a good idea to have a sketch for reference. I've included a link to it in the description below. First, press the letter K for the Live Paint Bucket tool or select it from the toolbar panel. Change the fill to black and click on one of the squares to apply it or click, hold and drag to color a few squares at once. And keep painting the remaining squares with black so your pattern matches the template. Next we'll delete all the unwanted orange squares. First select everything, then go to Object, Live Paint and choose Expand. Next open the Pathfinder window and select Divide. Now either press the letter Y for the Magic Wand tool or select it from the toolbar panel and click on one of the orange squares. This will select all the orange squares at once. Now press the Delete key on your keyboard. Next switch to the Selection tool, select everything and let's resize it. Open the Swatches window and drag this design into it. And you can see our new pattern swatch here. Now double click on it to open the Pattern Options window. If you would like to learn more about all the features within this panel, please check out my other tutorial. I've included a link to it at the end of this video and in the description below. Make sure the tile type is set to grid. Click Done from the tab toolbar to exit this mode. Now select everything and press the Delete key on your keyboard. Let's draw a square to cover the artboard and it should be filled with the new pattern you've created. To make any changes to your pattern, double click on the pattern swatch again. If you would like to make the pattern smaller, for example, first make sure the Size Tile to Art option is checked and select the Pattern Tile tool. Then switch to the Selection tool and select all the black squares. Now click on the corner of the bounding box and scale it down. Click Done and your pattern should be automatically updated. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.